the, the first one was both. The first one was twice. Yes, guys, the first one. I get three videos from Chidemas. Three different videos. I want Mekuna listening to like pay attention. Yes, we go first of all. Starts with the first video of Chidema, the first confession of Chidema. Make we know how this matter started. How she made it known to the public that she actually killed him. But now she don't turn the story upside down. Chidima is a chameleon. She they change multiple times in one second. It was really key. We locked the door. I didn't know where he kept the key. So I, when I get to the door, he draw me back. And that, that was what happened. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the police department. Yes, sir. And the police department. She said that. The, 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 the first one was both. The first one was twice. Yes, guys. The first one on on the left side. That was the first one. And then when when I stabbed him the, the first one twice, I threw the knife on the bed. Then he was going for it while I went for it. So while I laid on the bed, that's when they came on me to, to hold the knife and that's when I managed and then and then when he dragged the knife on me, he managed to slice my hand and then as he was holding it, the knife broke. So it slipped up on his hand. I still managed to help help with it. But then it was now weak and then Okay, so why, why did you like, what was it about the first time that you did like, what did you do or what happened? I was, I was, I was trying to, I was sleep, I was trying to sleep, it was midnight, so we were drunk and we had um, smoked, so I was already like sleeping, and then, Continue. and then I was already sleeping, and then when he came and I was Was there weed in the room? Have you known this guy and how did you meet him? Exactly. Exactly. Uh, I've known him for four months, five months. I met him through friends. I tried to introduce him to you. Yes. Okay, so how regular do you think this is? Not regular. Not regular. Um, that was my first that's um um time long time yeah. okay so how long how long did you guys stay did you check in on sunday when did you die which day did you die and when did you leave him and how were you able to escape from the room after killing him or you just walked in the well why why was Lying there, I just I changed and then I left. The I looked for the key for where it is, it, and I left it there. So when you escaped, who did you reach out to? Where was the first place you went to? I didn't reach out to anybody. So how did you feel when? Yeah. 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 What did you do with the ATM letter? What is the ATM? I reduced the amount. How much? And um, three, three, eighteen. Three, eighteen. 
On confirmed reports, have you that in your original account you have about 10 million naira? How did you get such amount of money? I go leave her to watch the second latest one. Make her know how long she claimed the game for the second new video. Say she don't know the man. So this lady, she changes like chameleon. Everything about her from day one now fake, fake name, fake number, fake ID card, fake driver license, everything that was. In fact, make I not speak of Bodo Yubo. Make we just watch the second recent interview. She don't change everything completely from the first one. So we don't know where and how our police won't take start to even investigate. Even if we get original police, say our police are doing correct job. I beg, how they won't take start to investigate lies upon lies, story they change every day. He doesn't talk much about himself. He's quite busy, like a busy person. I would say that he, at some point in time, got to know that he likes to carry girls, like, and he smokes, he drinks, and takes drugs also. So I don't know deep about him. His character, he gets angry easily. He has issue with his wife, so, but, his children is what his target as family man. He wasn't into happy married life or something. It was just more of catering for his kids. I can't remember some of his friends that I met, but like remember their faces kind of really all their names. But I've met some people that I said friends something. I don't have ten million in my bank account. So I have like four hundred. Oh, 500 accounts. Michael gave me um, his laptop. He had two laptops, so I told him that I wanted laptop, so he gave me one. And that was what I sold to get the money. So it's a MacBook. I wasn't doing no show when I was with him anymore. I was getting more from the him than doing the ushering, so there was no need on um, ushering. Ushering can be 15k, 20k. It gives me more than the ushering. The apartment where it was said it was leaking. So then they said I should go. They said it was free and I too was free. So like less than see. Um, it was Sunday on the 13th. Yeah. I decided to check online about the um, shortlet. Because it said that I didn't want a hotel. There will not be next place or like it's not be fun like being in the house or something. So that was when I decided to check for a shortlet. So I sent it to him and he said it was okay. Then he said I should go check the place out. So I checked it and it was okay. Then he made payments. He sent one of my that was for like four days and after I paid the money. So after like one hour, he came. When he came, then we went to get food. We went out to eat and also get drinks. And we we'll just be, we we'll just indoor watching movie, drinking, smoking. He woke up before me, but I was still feeling sleepy and dizzy because of the smoke, drink, and the drug. So he asked what and what we I need, like what we need. So I was like, um, we need to buy food and drug because the, the drug that we brought already finished. He sends the money to the account. Why the other one? He gave me the card because he was trying to make payments and it didn't go through. So he gave me the card. I didn't have access to his card, but I I know the pin code. Before I was leaving, he stood up to lock the door. But when I got in, I was knocking. Uh, as there was no answer, I opened the door, was already open, like it wasn't locked. And the duvet was on the floor, plus pillows. 
the the bed the couch was facing the door and the bed was stained with um, blood already and um, the floor where it was was blood and then music was on the tv was on the room was already disarranged like someone broke in then i saw him on the floor i didn't know what to do i took my things with this thing and left i was just i was afraid i didn't know if i have raised alarm they would have arrested me for doing it because i and him were just the only people in the room i was i just i just left i was packing my things to leave then i noticed that my clothes were stained so i changed it to another i took the bag that contained his id and documents bank statements my bag was already on the floor i met my bag on the floor and then the stuff it was with was was on the tv set that's where the stuff i took was on on the tv set so i just packed them and just put them into the nylon and left i took his phone on the following week i was home then i went out to withdraw some money from the um atm that i was with I read 200. Before that day, um, on Tuesday, you already told me that he's going to give me the money that I requested for. And when I came out, when I was arrested and they were saying I made away with 5 million naira, there was no 5 million naira in the account. I just did it. It's not like I had something to do with his death. I never had anything to do with his death. The lady that I rented the the apartment from, I had to make it hard that she should please probably send the security guy to check on him. That I haven't seen, I haven't heard from him. That's what I said to her. And they came to my house and they arrested me, took me to the station. I didn't involve anybody. I don't know who must have come into the apartment. Definitely somebody did that, but I don't know who that person is. I don't know what happened when I left to buy the food. I don't know. Because of the thing I did after not alerting police and then also withdrawing money, I feel guilty for what happened. I did not kill him. No issue whether I did not kill him, but my doings, taking his money and not reporting the police. I believe that somebody knew where we were and then waited till I left before they could enter. The pressure and people, when I was talking to security guy and it was like, no, nobody entered into the apartment that it was just me that entered into the apartment. And when they see story, they change from one color to another. <laughs> this na, na tall, they just they carry this girl, they do tall. Because if they really torture her, we go hear the truth. When they hear story, you and the man never stay long. How you take no say the man and the wife get problem. You constantly know say the man they carry many women. So the man make you know say they carry many women. He go sit down, they discuss with you, his girlfriend, saying they carry many women. Which man go discuss this kind of matter with him? Babe, no cheater. You know if you know as wife or as girlfriend, say your your husband or your boyfriend they cheat. They are smart. So that's one she don't already lie for that one. So the man just discuss in family matter to you. He and the wife no day. Now he just now the children just day after. He just day after the children. Anyway, when I don't know say this lady they lie. Okay, 
Somebody, you come out, come back, jam, say somebody die. You know, shock, shout, make people gather. You just find where in ATM day, carry arm, come bath, come change clothes, come waka. And you say you shock. And you say you surprise. My, this lady, she never begin confess. So. They never torture her. If they torture her, she go begin to talk waiting they happen. You can't meet somebody, may don't buy, no be you buy the person. You shock, you no shout. You carry the person ATM. Who give you the pin code? No man lie lie in your own personal account. You go carry pin code. Eighty five percent of Nigerian men no go give their own wife or children their pin pin number. Lie lie. Talk less of you, gay. Because you find past the wife. I be now you sabi kere wa past the wife. May go carry him. My people, this lady never even begin to talk. She never start to the talk. She never start to the talk. Okay. Make we can't enter our Nigeria government, the lawmakers. The one made them talk, they spoil everything. It's as if eh, this lady, like say, what did she do make sense? Our lawmakers, I know they understand what they they talk. Oh. Whether they say they free the lady, oh. whether they say they don't they suspect say police won't kill the lady, oh. uh, they made them make sure say the lady they are alive. Oh. If she can't die, and so what? She not kill somebody, or she not gang up with people may kill the man. If she can't buy for the police station, if really say they don't want to do magomago mago say now she really buy. We go they rejoice now because justice don't already come. What in Nigeria lawmakers they talk? I don't understand. Make when I listen to what our so called lawmakers they talk. Make when I explain, put them for comment section because me, I know they understand them. Now, person die now, they talk here, yeah, oh, no be chicken die. This matter, the way that they treat and they handle the matter, it's as if nobody die. It's as if not just worship and song and praise now they do for inside ch church. This matter, no be like matter made day for police station or matter made them really want to find out the truth. Now, so it just looked like. I am here to move a mention of urgent public importance because of the time frame involved. And it's a call for the compliance of the Nigerian police force with the laws of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and to ensure proper investigation into the death of late Mr. Usifo Ataga. Mr. Chidi Maojuku, a 300 level mass communication student of the University of Lagos, was arrested on Wednesday, 23rd June, over the murder of Chief Executive Officer Super TV, Mr. Usifo Ataga in a service apartment in the Lake area of Lagos. Aware that since the arrest of Ms. Chidi Maojuku, she has been paraded around, granting interviews to various several news platforms, including the Nigerian Television Authority, causing the internet and news media to be agog with the discussion and dissecting the matter. This is despite the fact that the police have already launched an investigation into the matter. Further aware that the law of Nigeria does not allow for social media trials and matters that are sub subjudicious, meaning before the court, or not yet judicially decided. These are not to be discussed by the media, or to the media by the police. Further aware, sorry, cognizant that Section 36.5 of the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, 1999 as amended, provides that every person who is charged with a criminal offense shall be presumed to be innocent until he is proved guilty. Thus, so long as Ms. Ojuku has not been proven guilty by the Court of Competent Jurisdiction, she is not to be labeled a criminal or paraded about to conduct interviews on a case currently under investigation. Rather, the police are to conduct a pro proper investigation and allow the court to consider the matter and make, all, make an informed judgment. Concerned that if Mrs. Oju Ms. Ojuku continues to be paraded about for a social media trial, it could affect the determination and outcome of the case as well as amount to a breach of her fundamental right to fair hearing, especially where she is labeled or treated as one guilty of a crime. Therefore, I'm asking the House and my prayers as follows. Resolve to call on the Nigerian police to conduct a proper investigation into the matter and refrain from parading Ms. Chidima around to grant interviews on the matter under investigation. Call on the Inspector General of Police to call all police personnel to order and ensure that there is no repeat of this type of violation of human rights and media access to arrested persons in future and therefore avoid compromising the case in the court of law. This is to ensure future cases are not treated in the same manner. Also ensure that Ms. Ojuku, the accused, 
does not die in custody or commit suicide while awaiting trial, as in some past cases. So I so move, Mr. Speaker. All right, Mr. Speaker.